energy level diagrams for molecular orbitals. There are certain conditions for the combination of atomic orbital. Let us discuss them first. Conditions. First point, combining atomic orbitals should have almost same energies. Combining atomic orbitals should have almost same energies. Example. In the case of homonuclear diatomic molecules like hydrogen, hydrogen contains two hydrogen atoms, one less orbital of one hydrogen atom combines with the one less orbital of other atom. Like this only combination takes place. Uh, one less orbital of one atom uh, cannot be overlap, uh, cannot be combined with the uh, 2s orbital of the other atom. That is, both the atomic orbitals should have almost same energies. Second one, combining atomic orbitals should have same symmetry. Okay, combining atomic orbitals should have same symmetry. Okay. Example in the case of 2p orbitals. Okay. 2px orbital of one atom can combine only with the 2px orbital of other atom. Okay. That means both the orbit, both the atomic orbitals must have same symmetry. Okay, 2px orbital cannot be overlapped with the 2py or 2pz. Only those atomic orbitals having the same symmetry must combine. Okay, next third point. The extent of overlap between atomic orbitals of two atoms should be large. The extent of overlap between the atomic orbitals of two atoms should be large. Okay. So, greater the extent of overlap greater will be the electron density between the two nuclei okay so stronger will be the bond so the extent of overlap between the atomic orbitals of two atoms should be large so these are the different conditions next we are discussing the designation of molecular orbitals so atomic orbitals are designated as s p d or f similarly molecular orbitals are designated as sigma phi delta etc okay first sigma molecular orbitals sigma molecular orbitals are cylindrically symmetrical about the internuclear axis cylindrically symmetrical about internuclear axis. Okay. So, for example, by the addition of oneness orbital, addition of oneness orbital can be represented as sigma oneness. Okay. And the subtraction of oneness orbital are designated as sigma star Oneness. Okay. Similarly, in the case of 2s, 2s orbital, sigma 2s represents the addition of 2s orbital and sigma star 2s 
represents the subtraction of 2s orbital. Now, in the case of 2p orbitals, it is assumed that 2pz orbital lie along the internuclear axis. Okay, 2pz lie along internuclear axis. So, the addition of 2pz orbitals are represented as sigma 2pz and the subtraction overlap. Subtraction overlap of 2pz orbitals are represented as sigma star 2pz. Okay. Now, second one is pi molecular orbitals. Pi molecular orbitals are formed by the lateral overlap of p orbitals. Lateral overlap of p orbitals. Here 2px and 2py orbitals are uh, undergo uh, this uh, pi molecular orbitals. So in the case of 2px addition overlap. Results sigma 2px and subtraction results sigma sorry, pi, pi 2px and subtraction overlap represents pi star 2px. Similarly, in the case of 2py, addition overlap represented by pi 2py and subtraction represented by pi star 2py. Okay. Like this we can designate the different molecular orbitals. Okay. Now let us draw the energy level diagram for molecular orbitals. Okay. So in the case of 1s atomic orbitals it contains two molecular orbitals sigma 1s, sigma star 1s then 2s contains sigma 2s, sigma star 2s and so on. Increasing order of energies of various molecular orbitals will be like this. Sigma 1s, sigma star 1s, sigma 2s, sigma star 2s, sigma 2pz, then pi 2ps and pi 2ps, same energy, then pi star 2ps, pi star 2py same energy then comes sigma star 2pz and so on. This will be the increasing order in the case of different diatomic homonuclear diatomic molecules like H2 H2 plus then HE plus HE HE2 then Li2 B2, O2, F2, N, Ne2, etc. All these are follow the same energy order. Okay. Some other molecules will follow the other order that we will discuss after this. So first those molecules which follow this energy level diagram. In this case if the electron contains only oneness electrons then it will be filled only this orbital. Then depending upon the number of electrons, electrons are filled in different orbitals according to their energy. So this is the increase in energy order. First the electron fill 1s, then 2s, then 2p. Okay. So in this case 1s orbital contains 2 molecular orbitals, sigma 1s, sigma star 1s, then 2s contains sigma 2s and sigma star 2s. In the case of 2px, each atomic orbital contains three, three orbitals, okay, 2px, 2py and 2pz. 2pz is having the sigma, 2pz is having the least energy, okay. Then comes pi 2px and pi 2py, same energy, then, then pi star 2px and pi star 2py, then sigma star 2pz. So, electrons are filled like this. If it contains two electrons, fill this, then comes this, like this, the electrons are filled in different molecular orbital. This is in the case of these diatomic homonuclear diatomic molecules.
okay the order will be different in the case of some other molecules like b2 c2 etc n uh, b2 c2 n2 etc that we will discuss next so the energy level diagram for molecules like b2 c2 and n2 are different in this case sigma 2 pz is having more energy than pi 2 px and pi 2 py the order will be like this sigma 1 s sigma star 1 s 2 s sigma star 2 s then comes pi 2 px pi 2 py okay then sigma 2 pz pi star 2 pz x and pi star 2 py then sigma star 2 pz and so on so electrons are filled in this order okay so in this case the, this is the energy increase first 1 s 2 s then in the case of 2 p pi 2 px and pi 2 py is having more energy sorry less energy the lower energy than sigma 2 p 2 p z so this will be the order this is due to an important reason because in the case of these compounds 2s and 2pz orbitals are very close to each other due to their close proximity there's intermixing of these orbitals are taking place so sigma 2s sigma star 2s sigma 2pz and sigma star 2px undergo intermixing as a result sigma 2pz raised their energy okay due to this reason sigma 2pz is having more energy than pi 2px and pi 2p okay these are the different energy level diagram for different molecules